This course is brought to you by AppyPy as part of our Academy series. Hello and welcome back. As you can see, I am currently searched SIM-free mobile phones on Google. Now you're thinking, what on earth is he doing? Now as you can see, just underneath the search, it says volume, 12,100 per month. As you can see, the first one there. And then cost per click, CPC is £1.32. And after that, it says the competition data. And then there's a little star after that. So in this video, I'm going to give you information as to what on earth this is, how to get it, as it is so, so, so helpful and important to you. And yeah, I'm just going to talk about it to you. So let's get straight into it. First of all, as you can see, that's the data we've been talking about just here. It's underneath the search box where you search what you're going to search. And then there's a button, there's a little button down here that says add all keywords. We'll get into that a little bit later. And then if you scroll down, the search is related to this. You always have all of these, but all of these are added now because of that, because of this uh, little tip I'm about to give you. Now, these are super helpful. It says how many searches worldwide per month each of these phrases get. So as you can see, this phrase here, SIM free mobile phones gets exactly 12,100 searches per month worldwide which is less than I thought to be honest and the cost per click for it is £1.32 I've currently got that in uh, British pounds but you can change that to dollars or any currency you want alright so let's talk about what this is head over to the website keywordseverywhere.com and that is where you'll find this out so click install for Chrome and it will take you to the Chrome web store and this is exactly where you will want to um, where you want to get it so all you want to do is click add to Chrome. I've already done that, but then it will go through a little thing for with you. So, so telling you basically how to add it to Chrome. Once you've done that, I'm just going to head back to the website because it will it will open the website once you've installed it and it will take you to this website. It will take you to this page on the website. All right. So once you've got it installed, there will be a, a little K at the top right on your icons. Uh, this is where your extensions go. As you can see, I've got a couple up here. And then you just want to click it and then click update settings. And as you can see, you've got to put an API key in just here. Now to get that all you have to do is put in your email address and they'll email you your API key and then you'll get access to this Chrome extension and it'll start working. And this is also where you can change the country so you, it can either be global or Australia, Canada, India, New Zealand, South Africa, United Kingdom or United States. And it also says new countries are added every month so they're still updating this and improving it for everyone to use which is fantastic. Now you can enable or, or disable metrics. So there's the volume, the cost per click and the competition. Now just for this, I'm going to disable the competition just so you can see what it's like when one's been disabled. And then you can en enable or disable the extension on any of these websites as this works on a lot of different websites as you can see just here. So that is absolutely fantastic. Um, it does work on YouTube. Oh yeah, it does say it. It does work on YouTube as well, which is really awesome. So yeah, that's always there eBay, that's a good one, Amazon, so if you want to sell stuff on uh, websites like that as well, that's always, always handy. And then you can highlight a volume, highlight a cost per click, or highlight a competition if it is over a certain amount, like this. And then you can choose the colour you highlight it with as well, which is awesome, but I'm not going to do that, as I don't really, don't really care. And then, yeah, so now let's go back to this search, and I'm going to tell you what this Add All Keywords button does. So you can either click the Add All Keywords just here, or you can click the little star just here. I'll click it here. And then once you've clicked it, you'll have all of those keywords um, that are similar to this saved for you. So where will they be saved? Once again, you want to click the little K and then go to my favorite keywords just here, which is really easy. And as you can see, it has saved just the first one. Oh, yeah, sorry. If you just save the, um, use the star just here, it just saves the one you've searched. But if you use the but button at the bottom right, which says add all keywords, it will save all of them. So if I go back to it now, where is it? Here it is, and then refresh the page. There we go. It has all of them on here now. So all of the ones down here, as you can see, are now on here. So that's absolutely fantastic. So now we know what that's all about. You can always copy them. So that if I click copy, they're all copied. So if I then go to paste something, it will paste them all. Uh, you can get them to an Excel, a CSV, a PDF, or you can print them. So that is absolutely fantastic. You can either copy them or export them or print them then basically. So that's awesome. And then I'm going to select all of them and delete all of them. Sorry, you can either delete selected if you've selected them 
or if you want to delete all of them, you can just delete all of them by clicking delete all like that. So that's really easy to use. So we're just going to have a look at a few different searches and what the different information is like on them. So as you can see, uh, that's Simfree mobile phones. We've already done that, so I'll close that page now. The next one we've got is solid wood flooring. Now the volume for that is 9,900. The cost per click is £2.48 and the competition is one. Now what I'm going to do is change this to dollars real quick. So if I go to uh, currency and go all the way to the top, United States dollar, and then refresh this page, you'll see that it's now in dollars. And you'll see it's also now got the competition gone because I unticked it so that it's gone. So that's awesome. So you can see that it does work. And as you can see, the volume is 9,900 and the cost per click is $3.22. So that is fantastic. So the person who is paying to get this top um, search result pays $3.22 clicks for each click. So if I click that right now, it costs them $3. So that's mental. So yeah, that's the data from that. And then if you scroll down, you get the search um, information for the next few keywords, keyword uh, phrases down here as well. So the best one with the most searches is 33,100 and that's engineered wood and flooring and that's four dollars and 89 cents which is insane so we've had a look at that one now let's have a look at a few more so next we have their website again and then they'd also have a youtube channel which is called keywords everywhere but i'm not going to go on to that right now i'm just going to leave that so i'm going to close that you can search that yourself and the next one we have we search is learn programming okay so this is online courses or anything like that for programming as you can see, um, I'm just going to refresh the page as it's still in pounds. And yeah, so there you go. It's 14,800 searches a month worldwide. And the cost per click is $1.99. So yeah, that's that for Learn Programming. I would have thought that was more to be honest because that's not that many worldwide. But I guess it is a month. So it's just an average as well. So yeah, that's that. And if we scroll down, as you can see, the best one is Learn to Code. So people search Learn to Code the most. And that is four dollars and twenty-eight cents, and thirty-three thousand searches. So if we click that, as you can see, the data all comes up at the top here. The top one's Code Academy, Code School. So if you can get to the top here, you will be able to sell your product very well. I must say that. <laughs> that's really good. I must say, uh, thirty-three thousand. Yeah, that's awesome. And the next one we have is Online Courses UK, as you can see. So this is mainly going to be. Um, people in the UK paying because if you're paying from America it's a bit bit of a waste of time but I suppose yeah so as you can see the main one is Open University which is the university in England where I'm from and that gets 5,400 search results a month search results sorry I mean um, searches a month that's the volume per month not search results uh, the amount of search results is here that's about 130 million <laughs> and the cost per click is $1.83 so that's not too bad, really. They only pay one dollar. Um, yeah, and that's a, a university, a bit like a college, I think they call it in America. So yeah, that's that. I'm not too sure. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest with you. And then, as you can see, we scroll down. We have all of the others. So the most expensive one is online college courses UK. That's two dollars fifty-five, and it only gets five hundred ninety searches a month. So that's quite crazy, really, how that is. All right, next we have SEO online course. Now for that. It only gets 720 searches a month, it, but it costs £3.85. If I refresh that, you'll see in dollars that it is $5. So that's actually, actually crazy. So this Linda website pays $5 per click on their ad, which is insane, absolutely insane. So if I change that just to SEO, as you can see, it then goes to 673000 and it costs $4.60. So it's actually gone, yeah, it's gone down. SEO costs less than SEO online course, which is a surprise, really. I would have thought that SEO people would be paying more for that, but they're not. So yeah, that's that. And we've just got two more after this. The first one is ready mix con uh, cement, not concrete, sorry. And that it gets 4,400 searches a month. It costs only 40 pence, or how many cents? Let's see. It costs 52 cents per click. So this ready to pour down here, is paying 52 cents per click and I'm pretty sure that's UK only yeah dot UK so that's probably a British based business and they're paying about 40 40 um, pence or 52 cents and there's 4,400 such results uh, not results sorry I keep saying that I don't know why 4,400 searches per month and then as you can see 
you have all of the other searches, ready mix cement B&Q, <laughs> that one looks like um, it's not working probably, or there's not enough data to actually uh, take it in, because it looks like 210 is the minimum they put on here, which is very interesting. And finally, we've got UPVC windows, which is a type of window uh, which you can buy for your house. But I just thought that would be an interesting one, because people do like to pay to advertise like, you know, there's always people saying, buy doors and windows, buy doors and windows. This is how much they pay. $4.26 per click, which is crazy. Absolutely crazy. And it gets 400, and, no, not 400, 49,500 searches a month, which is which is pretty, pretty insane, really. And then as you can scroll down, you can see all of these ones. None of them get too many. UPVC windows online. Uh, that gets a bit, $3.05. Um, oh, here we go. UPVC windows made to measure only gets 590 searches a month, but it gets $4.40. Yeah, so that would probably be about £3.30. It's um, quite difficult to change it just in my head, but that's about that's about ish. That's about right. But yeah, so if we do another search right now just for windows, like that, it might become up, it might come up with Microsoft Windows. Yeah, there we go. But in matter of fact, Anglian Home, who are selling Windows, uh, that gets 1.8 million searches a month. That's crazy. Um, they are paying $4.25 to get to the top there. So if we click on their website, you can see... Um, yeah, so it doesn't look like... Let's see, UPVC Windows. Uh, let's just click on one real quick. Sorry, this is nothing to do with SEO or anything, but it's interesting. Yeah, you can't actually buy it straight from their website, which does make it interesting. You can't actually buy straight from their website. All you have to do is get a quote. So that is interesting, because they're not actually selling products straight online. That's really interesting, actually. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Let's see if they're selling something else. Nope, uh, it looks like you need a quote for everything that they sell. So that's crazy. Um, they pay that much, and all they do is give quotes. They don't actually sell products straight online. That's pretty pretty crazy, really. But when they do sell products, they sell things like conservatories. So the money does come through for them. <laughs> so yeah, that is that. That is Keywords Everywhere. If I go back to their main website now, um, is there an easy way to do this if I go to the Chrome Web Store and then click it on here? Nice. So yeah, that's that. That is Keywords Everywhere. As you can see, this is the website. It says exactly what it is and what it does. And it says, how does it work? Um, as you can see, there's all these different websites it works with. And you can have a, a deeper look into it yourself. But I'm just telling you the basic stuff. So yeah, there's a button straight from the website to go to the settings by clicking over here. Video tutorials takes you basically to their YouTube videos. Um, FAQ, contact us. So yeah, basically they've got a little menu up here um, with a few different things you can look at, but none of that's too important. It's quite simple to use, very easy to use, and it works for Chrome and Firefox as well. So that's absolutely awesome. So yeah, that's that. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope, it, I hope you actually learned a lot from it. Once again, thanks, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.